Hey guys, it is Arika Misha, and today I'll be showing you a nice quick video of my homemade biscuits. Two quick ingredients. I have flour, of course, duh, and I have heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream and flour. That's it, that's all, because I ain't got all day. And I'm gonna get you in and out of the kitchen. Some nice homemade butter biscuits. All right, so two cups of flour, two cups of heavy cream, that's it. That's it, that's all you gotta do. Make sure I got my flour even here. One cup of flour. Quick and easy, y'all. Might be the quickest video you ever seen, but two cups of flour, two cups of heavy cream. That is it. Now you can add what you want, do what you want now. I'm just showing you what I do. All right, so, got flour everywhere, but Ugh, I would be so messy. All right, y'all. Got my two cups of flour in there. Uh, get this table cleaned off. All right, two cups of flour, and then two cups of our heavy cream. Two cups of heavy cream. That's it. And that is all. Alright. Get all this flour cleaned off the table. Ugh. Flour can be so messy. Get my hands washed. All right, we're going to go ahead and get that all nicely mixed up. Let me get my hands dry here. All right. Easy peasy. All right, make sure y'all can see. And see, I got my fork. I'm just going to mix this up. Mix it all up real good. Of course, I'm just gonna knead it all together, and make my little, my little biscuit bites. Well, not bites, but biscuits. And I've got my pan here, um, Pioneer Woman pan. I'm gonna go ahead and spray it with oil. Lay my biscuits in there, 400 degrees for 15 minutes. In case y'all missed that, 400 degrees for 15 minutes. All right, so I gotta let mix up as much as I can with my fork. All right. flour back over here get my hands all nice and flowery flowery is that a word y'all flowery I don't think so but whatever yeah this is so I can just knead my dough together now most people put it out on the table in the counter and knead it together but I'm leaving it in my bowl either way as long as it get kneaded Put a little bit more flour on my hands, on my dough. I just knead it right there in my bowl. Ain't that serious? Knead it right there in my bowl. Now I am gonna have to lay it out so I can flatten it out and shape, you know, do my little biscuit shapes. So, but I just wanna get it all kneaded together right now. Okay. Just kind of, I just kind of fold it over like that. Knead it and fold it over. Make sure I get all my stuff out the bottom of this bowl, cause y'all already know how I do. So I'm gonna take it out. Let me get one of my cutting boards so I can lay it on one of my cutting boards. All right. little flour out like that so my dough don't stick. Y'all know how I go. Okay. Got our dough there. Let's get rid of this bowl. Alright. Got our nice doughy, floury hands. 
just gonna keep folding it over like that and kneading it. Kneading it is what they call it. All right. I just kind of flip it over like that. This side, that side, like that. Just knead it on up. For them homemade biscuits and I'm gonna put some butter across the top. Oh yeah, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good, good, good. Mm, 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 mm. It's easy y'all. Two cups of heavy cream, two cups of flour. Just, it's easy. I mean, it's just like the old school way of making biscuits, I mean. Pretty much only way I know. I mean, I know I uh, see some people add salt and butter and I mean, there's different ways of doing it. However you make your biscuits, that's your business. Make your biscuits how you make your biscuits. That is your business, boo. Make your biscuits. All right, y'all, I don't wanna make this a long video. So this is my dough. Of course, I'm gonna go ahead and roll it out, shape my biscuits, put in the oven. 400 degrees for 15 minutes, guys. I will be back to show y'all the grand finale. Les finish les biscuits. Hey, guys. This is Arika Misha. Y'all know I had to come back and give y'all that word of the day. The biscuits are in the oven. Of course, when they come out, I will show y'all those biscuits. But I had to come and show y'all this mess. This mess I made when I was making my biscuits. You know how you got to knead it in the flour. You got to put flour everywhere. Look at this mess. I just wanted to come back and tell y'all. See, it look a mess right now. Things may look a mess right now for you. But honey, in the end, God gonna work it all out. He gonna work it all out. Hot mess right now. Things looking crazy. You don't know where you gonna turn, how you gonna do it. When it's gonna get done. If God gonna come through, God gonna come through for you. Just pray and God will be there for you. What starts off as a mess, when God get through with it and he get his glory out of the situation, oh yes, it's gonna be good. It look a mess right now, y'all. Watch how these biscuits turn out. Mm, mm, mm. That's the word of the day that was in my spirit. God had been dealing with me about the same thing. Say, I got a lot going on right now, y'all. I got a lot going on right now. But you know what? It's a mess right now. But I'm trusting God, having faith in God. He gonna work it all out. I believe that. All right, y'all. Let me get these biscuits out the oven. Okay, guys, I'm back. I just took my first batch of biscuits out of the oven. They look delicious. I'm going to go ahead and throw a little butter across the top of my biscuits here. Yes, nice butter across the top. And let that just melt. I might stick it back in the oven to melt my butter, but nah. I think I'll leave it alone. The heat from the biscuits will melt the butter anyway. So... butter over there okay all right Got our butter across like that my timer off butter across the top like that all right that's our little quick homemade biscuits all right guys you seen me do it so you know i did it this is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.